All right, to kick off day eight, we're gonna start with an eating challenge. We're at Nessie Burgers. I'll show you the sign in a minute. Sight unseen. This is the contest. I need to eat one plate of fries and two burgers. Herbs and Rye doesn't think I can do it. If I do it, he pays. If I don't do it, I pay. And then Lake Elsinore Poker for day eight after this. So I still, I haven't seen these yet, but Herbs and Rye just told me that I have a better chance at coming back from the challenge. I'm like $2,000 down with three days to go. He says I'm more likely to win the poker challenge than to eat all this in one sitting, but we'll see. All right, here they are, two burgers. One, two, a lot of fries. Um, yeah, a little bigger than I thought, but should still be no problem. I mean, it's only two of them. And I've watched enough Beard Meets Food videos to understand the strategy. All the carbs at the end, everything else first, fairly quickly, no breaks. I watch those videos all the time when I'm going to sleep, so I'm pretty much an expert at it. Beard Meets Food 2.0, basically. I had to pause it. I was worried the battery wouldn't make it the entire time just running for like a half hour But I am down to the last two fries I'm using pickles because the taste of everything has kind of disappeared at this point, but I am making it All right here it is this is where you order that's where we ordered That's where we ate and I won the challenge. And this is the scenery I got to look at while I won that challenge, so handily. A lot better scenery than like near my parents' house. And in Vegas. Anything to say after losing that challenge? I'm pretty sure you cheated. Yeah. I finished one order of fries, two burgers, put some Thousand Island and some mayo and some ketchup on everything. It took two and a half hours. It That's why you couldn't film the whole thing. It didn't take two and a half hours. Uh, I would say between 25 and 30 minutes and uh, Yeah, so not only did I win it didn't take very long either That is a Costanza line. I would be very impressed if anyone knew what episode that's from and now we're gonna go to uh, Lake Elsinore play some poker and since herbs and rye said I was more likely to do this than beat him in poker. I can only imagine that I'm gonna have like a $1,500 day and make up a ton more ground than I did yesterday with my small loss, so we'll see. Okay, I know you guys are watching this like five days after the fact, but it's Thursday, so it's opening day of baseball, ton of games on the TVs inside, and it's also Trooper Thursday, so warm regards to everyone over at the Westgate having a good time, and I thought I would show you while I'm out here taking a break, the Econo Lodge. This is a motel first, small room with poker and some table games second. So that TV right there, if I could show you right there in the middle. That guy's watching The Office. You might not be able to tell. I could tell though. So it's just uh, two levels. It's a motel most of the way. And then you get over to that sign, that orange sign, and that's where like the desk is. And then beyond that, there's a little bit of the structure left. And that's, uh, there's like 12 poker tables. There's like eight table games tables. There's a restaurant kind of on the other side. And uh, yeah, that's about it. The uh, Lake Elsinore Econo Lodge. I might or might not be making up ground. If it is, it's not much. I am up like 150. I had uh, the biggest hand I played was top pair, which is the nuts over here. And uh, one guy had an open ender. Another guy had a straight and flush draw. I lost the main, but won the side. And I went from like low threes to about 500 when that hand was over. So I'm up about 150 now. Herbs and Rye, we haven't been on the same table the entire time. I don't know what he's in for, so could be up on him for the day. No idea, I'll know after. Uh, probably not a ton more, maybe like two more hours. We actually have to be up and out of here early tomorrow. He has uh, more work to do, and I'm gonna go with him, and then 
that's also the day we're driving to the LA area Hollywood Park and Hustler on the same day so bit of, bit of an early start tomorrow and this trip has not been you know hours centric I'm uh, seeing all these places two more new places to see tomorrow not really focused on tons of hours and uh, Saturday will be the last day just another day at uh, Lake Elsinore and then I head back to Vegas Sunday so when the session is over maybe like two three more hours I will let you know the final results my right, time at the bottom shout out to uh, Tim just met him at the table he was in uh, seat four I should hire herbs and rye as my PR guy because Tim didn't know about the channel until herbs and rye told him so what was your result today won two hundred and eighteen dollars he won rich. he won 218 uh, I told you about the hands I played during the break herbs and rye my result by the way plus 56 herbs and rye had a three-way all-in he had kings one guy had ace 10 one guy had 10 9 he held up uh things like that were happening at the table for a while and that's about it most of today's video was burgers tomorrow is hollywood park and hustler anything great to add northwood's in tomorrow that's the actual highlight of tomorrow oh the restaurant yeah all right so i'll show you uh some of that i guess i hear it's uh, american food and that's all i know so far cue the outro and remember Rice is a spoon food.